how to hack me. I'm gonna show you how to steal sensitive data from my company. I have this sensitive storage bucket and if it was anonymous access equals true, then we would be able to directly console in and exfiltrate any data that we wanted, but that's not the case, it is false. So we're gonna to have to work our way backwards and find another way in. There is one identity that has access to read from the bucket and let's keep going backwards. It trusts this identity, but to get access here, we would need to get code execution on this EC2 compute instance. So we would get code running on this compute instance, dump the environment variables to steal the credentials associated with the instance, and using those credentials, we would be able to become this identity and execute the rest of the attack path. All right, how do we get code running on the compute instance? We can do that by somehow getting a hold of this SSH key. If we got that SSH key, we would log in here. But there's a firewall rule. The firewall rule, SSH is commonly run on port 22, and then the firewall rule is saying that we have to be on this specific IP address in order for this attack path to even work. All right, so that's one thing to consider. What else do we have? The firewall rules also say that the compute instance is listening on ports 80 and 443. So these are web ports, meaning that this compute instance is very likely a web server because 80 and 443 are open to the internet. And this avenue means that we would want to find what web software is running on this EC2 instance. We would want to fingerprint it to find out if there are any vulnerable versions of that software so that we could find a way to exploit them and get code running on the EC2 instance to traverse this role assumption path and read from this storage bucket.